So what made you want to study law here at Bond? Um, actually, I was originally just going to study journalism, but then I think coming up here and looking at the moot courts and everything, it was a bit of an eye tell. I was like, oh wow, we actually get to use them? Like, is that actually a thing? So I think, um, and I'm really like passionate about people and animals, so I think that was a big teller for me. I was like, I can actually do the double degree, do both of my passions um, and get it done in three and a half years, opposed to five or six that would take in Melbourne. So I think, yeah, it was that and um, just pursuing the passion really. Have you been involved in any extracurricular um, activities since you've come to Bond? Yeah, um, my best friend and I actually did the Miscarriages of Justice um, moot last year, which was really exciting. It was a beginner's moot, so we were, we were both a bit um, scared of doing mooting at the first place because it's pretty intimidating. Um, and we ended up getting to the finals, so that was that was great, but I was, we were both so nervous because um, Justice, Kirby, Justice Kirby was coming to judge it and we were both like, I remember I cried like an hour before and she was freaking out too. He's a former judge in the High Court, but um, it was really great to get there and know that he was like so understanding. He said he remembered what it was like for his first moot, so he wasn't judging as harshly. So that was great, but I just can't, yeah, it was an amazing experience like to actually get personal feedback from him. Do you think that the, um, the small class sizes have, have impacted on your enjoyment of the place? Yeah, I really love the small class sizes. That's something that was a big, um, a big thing for me here too, because my high school had fairly small class sizes. And I think, especially in law, when you've got that practical problem, you know, you've got the practical problem that you want to speak through in a conversation style in your class. I think it gives you, it's a perfect environment to ask questions, um, give your opinion. Sort of like well, everyone's all in it together, I suppose. Yeah, exactly. And around exam times, everyone has study sessions and helps helps everyone. I know my friend tells me from Melbourne, um, no one would ever let anyone look at their law template before an exam, but um, at a bond, it's great like that. If you're having trouble with a specific topic, you just help over your friend, how, how does this work? And they'll explain it to you. So I think having that, um, that strong supportive network is something that you just don't get anywhere else, really. What's your biggest highlight of your time at Bond? Um, I think it's the people that make the place, to be honest. I think having that amazing social network, you have you have all your meals with everyone, you party with everyone. It's keeping that balance between your work life and your social life is really important. And it's something that's really stressed here, I think, and that's so important because if you're stuck in your textbook all the time, you're not going to have a good time here. Like That's part of the Bond experience. You need both. So having your friends at dinner and your friends all around you all the time is just really great. I think having like a second family.